6. Welcome back, everyone. With concerns growing about coronavirus, many are wondering how this could impact their pets. News finds Caroline Carruther spoke with one local vet who has insight on your pets and coronavirus concerns. The CDC recently released a statement saying while there have been no confirmed cases of transmission of COVID-19 from pets to people, they recommend you still keep a safe distance from your pet if you are sick. Now today I spoke with a local vet here in Mobile about his thoughts on this topic. In general, viruses particularly are generally species specific. There's always the exception to the rule, such as rabies. Uh, cats and dogs have their own respiratory viruses. You know, there's, a, there's actually a flu virus for dogs. And Dr. Wesson tells me that whether or not the virus itself can be transmitted from animals to people is still unknown, but there was a case in Hong Kong this year where the family was ill and their pet tested a week positive for the virus, but the pet was not ill. There, there shouldn't be any concern about, like, if a person is ill, their pet getting ill, okay? Um, so that's, uh, I would think that would be the biggest concern. Um, the CDC states, at this time, there's no evidence that companion animals, including pets, can spread COVID-19 or that they might be a source of infection in the United States. But they also say to keep a safe distance if you're sick until more is known about the virus. Dr. Wesson says that they are taking extra precautions in cleaning and contact to protect their customers and staff. You know, our receptionists are now, you know, trying to ask people, you know, if they're sick, they want to come in, we're glad to see them, but, you know, we don't want to expose our staff needlessly either, so we're glad to come out to the car to get them. We've already done that a few times, so uh, make it up. Reporting from Mobile, I'm Caroline Crithers for WKRG News 5.